Our community is growing. Clark County has seen recent population growth unmatched by any Southern Iowa County for over the last decade and a half. As a result of added jobs, added housing, and flourishing economic growth, Osceola and the surrounding communities are seeing tangible change. Change that means more opportunities, change that means more people, and change that means a truly exciting future. This future, as you and I know, rests squarely on the students of Clark Community Schools. They're the heartbeat of Clark County and the lifeline to continued growth and success. So as community leaders, parents, and teachers, it's our responsibility to provide them the environment and the opportunities they deserve and build Clark as the model district we know we can become. As part of the initial phase of our growth and renovation mission, the Clark Community School Board started making necessary changes. Through recent construction and updates at the high school, we've provided our students, the teachers, our administrative staff, and all associated with the schools additional security as well as plans for the proper space needed for learning and development. While this is a great start, we know we have a long way to go. Future phases of our mission include addressing space issues at the elementary school, where we're seeing class sizes grow exponentially as well as the needs for a more diversified and comprehensive curriculum. Clark's elementary school principal, Jill Kiger, has some unique insights to share. Sure, we have about 789 students in our building. It's a K-6 building, and we have a very diverse population including a high ELL population as well as uh, numerous special education students. We serve students from surrounding communities because we offer programming. And so those students are being served in lots of different places, including um, what were previous closets. We no longer have hardly any storage because our um, closets have been turned into very small classrooms. We have five title teachers. We, have, we will have this fall three ELL instructors as well as three uh, tutors for the native languages. And so those, a lot of those programming for ELL takes place with the tutors in the hallways or in the back of classrooms because we no longer have space for them to be in a separate location. Um, this last year was probably um, the year where we really had to crunch. In the middle of the year, we actually added a second level three special education teacher. And so we had to move a level one spe special education teacher to a smaller classroom so we could move our level threes and so they could have two classrooms. So at semester, we had to make a major change. And then this fall, we'll have an additional ELL teacher. In we have approximately 20 second graders who are being served by our ELL teacher and that number jumps to 30 and about 32, 33 in kindergarten and we see that number continuing with the incoming class. We do have a very unique opportunity here at Clark. We have a great programming. We offer lots of special ed services so we can attract and, and help out neighboring districts who are too small to provide those services. But we do have a problem with space. We're running out of room for those students to have the space that they appropriately need, um, as well as our ELL population. We're running out of space to serve them. And so we want to do the best job possible, but space has become an issue. With support from our community, and our leadership, these kids will be able to have the facilities they need to help them learn and grow. Other aspects of our program include improvements to some neglected facilities in which we do our jobs. Of course, Growth like this is a good problem for a community to have, but we need to be proactive in addressing the needs of our future students. Giving Clark students an environment that is conducive to learning and provides security and support is our first priority. With that, we want Clark Community Schools and our students to be the model district for education, innovation, and success for all of Southern Iowa and the Midwest. We have a unique advantage today to provide a foundation of excellence for our schools and our students. From developing academic programs to match our diversified needs, to providing the proper learning space needed today and into the future, Clark Community School District must take action to assure the success of our students and our community long into the future. With your help and support, we believe Clark Community Schools can become the model district we envision.